Hey, thank you so much for showing interest in Brown Family Law's Law Clerk program. My name is Marco Brown. I'm the owner of Brown Family Law, a divorce law firm here in Salt Lake City. And I wanted to give you a little bit of value in exchange for showing interest in what we're doing here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through the top five secrets that law schools don't tell law students. All right, let's get into number one. First secret is no one cares where you went to law school. I'm going to let that hang out there for a second. I know that you don't believe that, but it's true. No one cares where you went to law school. Now, that's actually not quite true. Some people care where you went to law school. And those people really are judges when it comes to clerkships. They will look at law school, especially if it's a federal judge. If you want a federal clerkship or you want to clerk for SCOTUS, obviously you're going to need to go to probably a top 10 school. Uh, especially the top five is where those people tend to come from. Uh, you can get in out of the top five if you have really good, uh, really good networking at your law school. But you know, federal judges they do tend to care where you went to law school. The federal government sometimes will care where you went to law school. Actually, not really all that much, but sort of. They you need to put it on your your CV and actually give that to them. But they tend not to care that much either. Okay. Very, very large, large, large law firms in large metropolitan areas will care where you went to law school. So if you want to work in downtown Manhattan or in downtown LA, Miami, Chicago, these humongous law firms, Kirkland and Ellis, these places, then it probably matters where you went to law school. That, however, accounts for less than 1% of attorneys in the United States. So it's not really all that that big a number. But look, if you want to live that sort of lifestyle and work for that sort of law firm because you think that's prestigious and whatnot, then you know go right ahead and they will care. And then the last group of people that really care where you went to law school are those jerk attorneys that want to feel better about themselves in relation to the people they work with in the office, okay? These same jerk attorneys are the same jerk law students who you know who don't want to socialize with the other law students who get worse grades than them. They like they ask everybody what their grades are and they put themselves in the social hierarchy depending on their their grades and they won't socialize with anybody below them in the hierarchy. Okay, we hate those people. All of us hate those people and thus we are one of those people. Uh, so really, those are the categories of people who care about law school grades. That accounts for a very, very small percentage of attorneys in the United States. For the rest of us, no one cares where you went to law school. I have hired a number of attorneys. We have uh, nine attorneys right now. I've hired a number of attorneys in my career. I can't tell you where half of them went, went to law school even now because I simply don't care about it. I care about how well they serve our clients and whether I like them how they get along with the team, okay? That's really what I care about, and that tends to be what the vast majority of legal employers care about as well. So when it comes to employers, the vast majority just don't, just don't care, okay? They're not really gonna know. You don't get a, a job at a law firm because of where you went to law school. You get a job at a law firm because you knew somebody, or you know, we're gonna talk in these other secrets about how much money you bring in, so on and so forth, how you serve your clients, but employers just don't really care on the whole. And then clients don't care where you went to law school. Now I get pushed back on this. Every once in a while, people will say, well, I live in Manhattan, and they asked me where I went to law school. Okay, I mean, if you went to Fordham, like, great. I don't think they're not going to hire you if you went to LSU, though. Like, I, I seriously don't think they care. I think it's just a question that, that people ask sometimes. But I have met with over 10,000 people in my career, helped about 4,000 people through law school. I've had less than 10 in the last decade ask me where I went to law school. And fewer than that, and, and most of those were just kind of asking the question, but people who actually made the determination of whether or not to hire me based on where I went to law school is probably five, okay? So clients simply don't care. Clients care how you make them feel. Clients care that you will solve their problem and you will do it compassionately and without trying to screw them out of money, okay? But they really want you to solve their problem. The more you make them feel like you are going to solve their problem, like you are the person that is going to do that, the more likely they are to hire you. Okay? That is 95% of the game. 
where you went to law school is essentially 0% of the game. So again, number one secret, no one cares where you went to law school.